Here is the MC1496 AM modulator that I've put together a uh, test circuit, some uh, transistors to buffer and amplify it, and I got a coil here and an indoor antenna. Here's the schematic for the AM modulator and also the RF buffer amp. Right now I'm using playing a 1 kilohertz tone. This is a trapezoid display which compares the actual audio signal with the RF signal. There's zero modulation and turn it up and it'll over modulate. Now with this kind of modulator you'll notice it uh, will not go to flat line. It'll splay out the other direction but um, that there is perfect 100%. That's a uh, perfect trapezoidal pattern. Here we have the SS Tran uh, AMT3000, uh, and all I'm putting out is an RF signal here. It's going into the MC1496 uh, modulator, and over here, down here, is the audio source, the uh, CD player, and it's feeding it a one kilohertz tone or whatever I put into it. And over here we have the oscilloscope with the probe looking at this point out of the modulator and excuse, and then into a, um, a matching coil, then into an antenna here. And so this is the overall diagram of how I've got this set up. So now we'll do a frequency sweep. I'm going to be listening on this radio. So there's the tone from our CD player into the modulator using this CD using track 39 which is uh, 1 kilohertz reference tone and has 5 hertz to 20 kilohertz sweep. This is a reference track and in a moment it'll do the whole sweep. Here it goes. That's like 5 cycles per second. Now it slowly sweeps upward. going up about 300 hertz in a second here. Now we can hear it on the radio. There it goes. Still flat. There it is, it's done. The MC1496P.